in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. You are listening to the Good Night message on this Saturday the 30th of November 2024 broadcasting from the Salesian Pontifical University Rome Italy by your servant Father Eustace Siame a Salesian of Don Bosco with this encouraging and strengthening message being the last day of the month entitled Gratitude is a matter of the heart As we reach the close of November, it is an opportune moment to pause and consider the profound power of gratitude. Gratitude is not simply a fleeting feeling to be expressed intermittently. It is a deep-seated attitude that has the potential to transform our lives. By examining the treasures we hold instead of the trials we face, we allow our hearts to be filled with appreciation and hope. This mindset aligns beautifully with 1 Thessalonians chapter 5 verse 18 which encourages us to give thanks in all circumstances for this is God's will for you in Christ Jesus. The world often presents us with myriad challenges and uncertainties yet it is precisely during these times of difficulty that gratitude becomes a beacon of hope and strength. When we focus on what we have even amidst adversity we cultivate resilience and find light in the darkest of places cultivating a grateful heart enables us to see opportunities where others see obstacles Philippians chapter 4 verse 6 to 7 reminds us not to be anxious about anything and to present our requests to God with thanksgiving promising peace that transcends all understanding gratitude serves as a lens through which we interpret our experiences and interactions it allows us to recognize the blessings that may otherwise go unnoticed by maintaining a thankful heart we become more aware of everyday miracles the warmth of a loved one's smile the beauty of nature and the kindness of strangers in Psalm 107 verse 1 we are called to give thanks to the Lord for his good his love endures forever underscoring the unending blessings he provides furthermore gratitude strengthens relationships by fostering a spirit of appreciation and understanding when we take time to express genuine thanks to others we build deeper connections and nurture a sense of community and togetherness This practice not only elevates others but also enriches our own lives. As Colossians chapter 3 verse 15 to 17 advises, let the peace of Christ rule our hearts and be thankful, allowing gratitude to guide our interactions and enrich our lives with harmony and compassion. In moments of solitude, reflecting on blessings and expressing gratitude can foster a profound sense of inner peace this practice shifts our focus from what we lack to what we have generating a positive outlook that propels us forward gratitude is a tool that helps anchor our souls offering comfort and strength through life's ebbs and flows Consider Psalm 23 verse 1 which reminds us that as the Lord is our shepherd we have all that we need. Let this last day of November be a time to cultivate gratitude deliberately, recognize our blessings and inspire others to do the same. As you reflect on this month and look forward to the one ahead, embrace gratitude as a core value. a matter of the heart that shapes your perspective and fuels your spirit in doing so we align closer with god's vision for us and allow our lives to reflect his grace and generosity 
James chapter 1 verse 17 beautifully depicts this by acknowledging every good and perfect gift is from above. As we rest tonight, let us carry the warmth of gratitude into December and beyond. Practicing gratitude creates a heart filled with joy, heals emotional wounds and brings us closer to the divine. Through gratitude, we find endless reasons to hope and remain steadfast, regardless of the circumstances. Let the beauty of gratitude light your path and inspire others, for it truly is a powerful matter of the heart. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night, as it dreams. Same to you, Father. Father.